Home Assistant is a very popular open source solution for home automation. They are also making devices like Home Assistant Green, which I purchased a few weeks ago and I've already reviewed it in an unboxing video. Today I'm going to do the next step and I'm going to tear it down to have a look inside. Home Assistant Green is called this way because it contains a green printed circuit board with really interesting components on it. And while we're speaking about printed circuit boards, I have to tell you about our sponsor, PCBWay.com. No matter if you're looking for a prototype or if you're ready for manufacturing, PCBWay can help you with the manufacturing of high quality printed circuit boards. They can even help you with the assembly of components on your boards. Furthermore, PCBWay offers 3D printing, injection molding and metal sheet fabrication services. Step number one, let's start by disassembling Home Assistant Green. Home Assistant Green has an amazingly good design that I really like and because of this it's very easy to disassemble it and assemble it once again. The process for disassembling is straightforward. There are four screws on the back which we need to unfasten in order to access the printed circuit board. The device contains three main parts. There is a beautiful enclosure made of translucent polycarbonate, a green printed circuit board and a large aluminium heatsink for noiseless CPU cooling. I really love how the mechanical design is done and I think there are three advantages. First of all, this is a very compact design. Second, it looks really good. And third, it's easy to assemble and disassemble it, which means that you can easily repair it and maintain it over the time. Let's have a closer look at the printed circuit board of Home Assistant Green. This is a printed circuit board with multiple layers, there are components on both sides. The solder mask of the printed circuit board is green and the seal screen is white. On the back of the printed circuit board you can see the new Home Assistant logo and the short text message with information about the project. So Home Assistant is open source home automation that puts local control and privacy first, powered by worldwide community of thinkers and do-it-yourself enthusiasts. On the same side of the printed circuit board you can also notice the Nabu Casa logo. This is the company behind the development of Home Assistant and ESP Hole. Home Assistant Green is powered by 12 volt direct current power supply. Furthermore, on the board there are a couple of USB ports, HDMI connector, micro SD card and an Ethernet port. There is a power button between the Ethernet port and the micro SD card slot. Home Assistant Green is using Rockchip RK356 system on a chip with a quad-core ARM Cortex-A55 CPU running at frequency at 1.8 GHz. The device is equipped with 4 GB DDR4 RAM memory. 32 GB eMMC flash drive is available for storage on Home Assistant Green. The energy consumption is about 3 watts while running and less than 2 watts at idle mode. In my opinion, considering the price of Home Assistant Green and the hardware capabilities, this device is a really good value for money. Home Assistant Green works with a CR2032 battery for the real-time clock. This battery is optional and it is not included in the device out of the box. I'm using this opportunity to plug in an appropriate battery. I did the teardown of Home Assistant Green, we had a look at the green printed circuit board, I added a real-time clock battery and now it's time to put all the parts back together so that I can assemble my device. The process is straightforward and very simple, just put together the three main parts and fasten them with the four screws. Once again, I have to say that I really admire this compact design because it's very easy to disassemble and assemble it. Probably the only disadvantage of Home Assistant Green is that it is not open source hardware. Yes, Home Assistant is open source software project, but the hardware of Home Assistant Green is not open source hardware, at least not for the moment. Home Assistant Green offers really nice hardware. It's great value for money. If you're interested in learning more details about this device, have a look at my video about unboxing it. I published this video a couple of weeks ago. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this type of content, please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and stay tuned for new videos.